Alright, I can hear them coming. Probably be able to see them this time around. He's right down there. Oh, I don't know if he can get up. It might be too muddy. <clears throat> Ah, oh, he's with the skitter down there. And he is spinning out. Where is it? This is chains. Not doing much good up here. I'm a big help. Let's try out quick though, here. Yeah. You told me I could skid today if it wasn't too muddy. I would be freaking out. Like, yeah, no thanks. He's getting it. A little out of time. Looks like he's wiggling it back and forth. Oh yeah, he's got it. I hear him swearing from here. Not that he ever swears. <laughs> well, suck down that fuel. It's cheap. Ah, uh, here he comes. He said he broke something in the dozer today when he got down in there. I don't know what it was. A sprocket or something. I don't know. Probably not a sprocket. <laughs> But he fixed that and then the hose broke so he had to walk back out and it took him 35 minutes. So I said, you need your four wheeler. And that was taking a shortcut through the woods. Come on, baby, you got this. Oh my God. I would literally be like scared to death driving that thing up that hill in the mud. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, that's the steepest part. Come on. Oh, yes. I got him a mushroom cheeseburger from Hardee's, so he's going to be loving that. Mushroom and Swiss after this hard workout. I'm sure a lot of you guys and girls are dealing with mud right now. We had a couple, oh, quite a long stretch of like 80 degree weather and nice and sunny and then back to 50s. Go. He's gonna love the little drums that I got for Evan. Oh, Jesus, I wonder if he sees me here. Look at 
that beast. Look at the view. Pretty, pretty farm way up there. Maybe they're the owners of this land, I don't know. mud since I got my sneakies on. <laughs> Look at his boots covered with mud. And you wanted me to drive skidder today? Heck no. Well, I didn't think it was going to be dry enough to skid. I thought I it know. would dry out. It'll dry out in three or four hours. I know, it dries quick. Dry. Yeah. But, oh my god. Oh my god, I was like, oh my god. That was scary. Well, it wasn't scary, it was aggravating. The tires just fell off the clay. I probably have to put the, if it keeps raining, I gotta put my traction bars on. Oh. Ooh. What a morning from hell. Uh, yeah, what was the thing I told <laughs> I'm sinking. Well, I know I had a bad roller on the dozer. A roller, I, I called it a sprocket. And it must have cocked in there sideways, and when it did, I felt it. I thought I was on a stump, and I gunned it a little bit. And, it went crunch and here it blew the back roller off behind the sprocket. It broke the bolt. Oh. So that come around fetched in the sprocket and the, the track was loose, you know. So I walked up, took me 35 <laughs> minutes to walk up out of there. Oh my God. So well, you burned off your breakfast. I popped, the, I popped the, the track started coming off. So I stopped, I was right in a slop hole. So, I walked back up the hill and got the cutter, tracked it down, and rolled the head on her and put the jib boom, or that squirt boom, under the track and popped it back up on. Well, I did that, it rolled the head and broke a hydraulic hose. Uh, so I'm like, I'm screwed, I gotta walk up out of here. <laughs> so I took the hose off, and I walked up out of here. It took me, like I said, it took me 35 minutes to walk up out of there. I just, I mean, you gotta stop, it's so steep, you just, I can't. Uh, so now you earned your nice mushroom so, Swiss burger. Yeah, and my boots. Yeah. So and my shoes. Oh, nice. The uh, the thing where it popped, it was right in this like cow shit mud about <laughs> that deep. So I had to go find a couple. I found a nice piece of split red oak about that long, about that wide. I flopped it down there in a couple of poles and made myself a deck to work on. That's what I'm standing on right now. Something. Yeah. Or, so I got that back together. I pumped the track up. I got the roller out. I had to lift the tra the slack chain, the slack track, and with the cutter. And I got the roller out, and the other one just spit out. So I'm in the same boat. I got to get it up here and put new. I got one new roller, and the other one's salvageable. But the bolts, we're gonna burn the bolts out. That's gonna be a nightmare. But whatever. So hopefully I can pull out a roller out. I'll just wait till Jess is here. Yeah, it looks like the sun's starting to come out. I can cut. I got an area I can cut. I'm just about done with the road. That I got a road. I got a road coming this way, and I got a road coming that way, and I had to bring it all into one and come down straight across that stupid gas line. I, I got that done. I Good. put my decks across the gas line. Look what I got, Evan. Come here. Oh boy, where'd you get them? I've been shopping today. Secondhand store. I gotta put this Ah. And we gotta get this out. The struggle is real. Mm. I wasn't planning on skidding. I know you could skid. <laughs> yeah. Maybe with the bars on. I would have been screaming all the way up that oh hill. Oh my god, you got on my drum set? I did. That second hand store. Really? $30. Oh my god. I, I called Dan and Jackie and they're like, yeah, get it. Look, oh it has a little foot oh, pedal. That's cute. See the foot pedal? Isn't that cute? Oh, that's cheap. 
and a drum set, drum oh. thing. You only got one stick? One stick. We can get another one. Yeah. I'm a better grandma because when Dan was like a little yeah. kid, I got oh. him the drumsticks. No drums. That was funny. So we got to get this radiator out because I also got one of those little tykes um, car you sit in and hey. drive. Billy Ray. Billy Ray. Bucket Billy Ray. Eat your heart out. Pause <laughs> jamming. Hey, I got one of those little tykes cars you sit in for $20, like $19.99. And they're like 50 something. It's pink, but I got all kinds of stickers and we're going to toughen them up. Toughen it up. <laughs> we'll put a can of Bud Light in the cup holder oh, for it. It's heavy. I couldn't get it. All right. TTFN, everyone. Oh, look, Wait, the... don't. Don't pull it. <laughs> You'll be the one who pulls that. Drop set out and it'll fall pull and break. Oh. Look at that. Wow. It's my coffin. Yeah, Walking pretty much. Yep. That's my new radiator. And then we also. Radiator. Yeah, 3500. Let's not break. I was going to pull it out, but it was too. It. Yeah, it was too heavy for me to do it. Maybe I'll put it in the back of the truck. I don't know. Wow. And it come with a little. And there's a little oh, thing in there, there too. Whew, I'm cold. I'm bottom on that dozer, but I don't. I mean, it's salvageable. I just got to put the roll. A little out of time. That's what you do. Pads. They put new pads on it. Yeah. I put sprockets on it. Sprocket. They're fairly cheap. Is that anyway. the twin skitter to the one for sale? Yes. There you go, people. You yeah. saw the rock and roll. Yeah, the other one runs good. Yep. All right, I gotta go and freeze, and I gotta get in the car. Ta-ta, y'all. TTFN, bye.